Any last words before we spawn this in? Oh, Just no. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't have any bucket of water as well, so. <gasps> hey guys, it's Fru, and welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft multiplayer survival. Now, we are all here inside my house. MD looking pretty fresh with the Ender Dragon head on, I must say. But guys, as you heard us say in the last episode, today is the day we fight. A little, little tease there on Prod's head. We are going to be fighting the Wither today. But guys, speaking of the last episode, I actually asked you what we should call this dog. So yeah, guys, in this episode, we are going to be naming the dog one of your guys' comments that you suggested in the last video. So guys, let's start off the episode by getting all of the stuff ready. And by the way, where are we going to be fighting this Wither? I was thinking, like, uh, we'll just... You know, I don't care. Whoa, 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 whoa! Let me go ahead and grab the wither head. I think I have it in one of these chests. All right, I got it. Have you got the soul sand prod, or do you want me to bring that over? No, I've got four, don't worry. Okay, so has everyone got everything that they need? Are we all equipped and ready to fight the wither? I guess. I think okay. So. Should we just run as far away as possible? Or are we doing it in the Nether? Where are we saying to fight this wither? Not in the Nether. I say I think you should just do it like somewhere around here. It flies, but not only does it fly, it literally just destroys everything it's around. So I want to do it. Like, should we just do it here? This is far. This is far enough away, yeah. I'd say. I think this is fine. We're going to be fighting it at night as well, so not only do we have the wither to worry about, we have these flying things around us as well. If, if we kill it quick enough, it might not do as much just damage. Alright, are we, are, we, are we doing it? One. Oh. <laughs> Two. Are you ready? The final one. I'm scared, I'm scared. Oh, no. Any last words before we spawn this in? Oh, no. I'm scared. <laughs> Yeet. Oh, no. oh my god. Oh no, oh no. Quick. Go, 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 go. Get. Oh no, it's travelling too far. I'm scared about this. Okay, this is a bad idea. Run, I need to run. run, run. I just realised I don't have my chest plate on. Why is it only going for me? There's three other people you could be going for with her. Okay, oh, no. almost half. Almost half HP. Almost. Oh my god, look at the amount of damage he's done. Why is it only me? There's so many. Come on, boys, please. Okay, okay. It's only going for me. I, I, I don't know what I've done to deserve this personally. Oh no. Oh no, there's a creeper here as well. Can guys, we on it now? guys, what is it doing? Go, can, can we get this over with? Can we get this over with? This is, I just want the beacon. I just want, I'm, I'm fighting this in third person right now. I'm an epic gamer. Oh my god. That was so stressful. Where's the star? Did it even drop it? I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. Oh, oh thank god, god for that. All right, here we go. Here it is. I, I would have thought you got an achievement for actually getting it, but no. Yeah. But here we go. We've got it, guys. We've got the nether star. So should we make a beacon? In the future, I want to make a netherite beacon. Just, just for the flex, honestly. Can you, so can you do, you do diamond? Do can you yeah, do you, can, you can do oh, diamonds. Yeah, all right, guys, so it turns out I have all the stuff here to make the beacon. We're going to make it. And I think for now, we're just probably going to go with like a medium sized type beacon. And then in the future, as I said, guys, I, I'm going to dedicate myself to get the netherite beacon. Okay, it's going to be a flex if we get it done because, I mean, I'm pretty sure it's like one of the hardest things you can possibly do in this game. I mean, honestly, I don't know if it is that hard to do, but I mean, it's just something I really want to do. But for now, I think this is what they're building. I might have to get some of my iron blocks. I just want to say, guys, it was, a, it was a great with the fight that we did right there. I mean, it, it did kind of target me the whole time, but you know, it was worth it. All right, here we go. Let there be the beacon. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was really, that, that took a while to actually work. But there we go. Bring home the beacon. All right, so there we go, guys. We got the beacon all up and running. The wither fight was honestly, it, it, it wasn't as hard as I expected it. It was just a little bit annoying that it was literally targeted, <laughs> targeted me the whole entire time. But yeah. Wait, so Zetra, while we're here, do you want me to go and get you uh, some elytras? Yes. All right, guys, so we're with Prod right now. And what we're going to do is we're going to head to the end and we're going to get Zetro his elytra back. Because if you guys remember last episode, go back and watch it if you haven't already. But basically, Zetro died in the nether, lost all of his stuff because it all burnt in lava. So we are going to go on a little adventure to get his elytra back because you need elytra at this point right we need elytra we've all got elytra so we're gonna go ahead to the end and we're gonna go get his elytra so let's go ahead and do it all right so we've made it to the end portal are you ready to go in have you got everything you need are we are we all good yeah, all right so. let's go so guys here we are we are back in the end this is another time we're gonna get someone elytra this is i think i think i got you elytras in the last episode right yeah you did all right, here we are. We're back in the end. All right, so I don't know what direction to go. Uh, I think we should just go... All right, guys, and quickly while we're flying to try and find NC, I just want to say thank you guys literally all so much for the support on the series. It's been absolutely crazy. In fact, we literally just hit 10,000 subscribers. So thank you guys all so much. We all really appreciate it. Like, we all read all the comments, and they're just so nice. So thank you guys. I'm just going to keep I'm just gonna keep going. I, I literally have no idea where I'm going. Oh, no. I, there's nothing around me. I, I, don't, I don't trust this. I do not trust this. If I run out of rockets right now, it's not going to be a good day. It's not going to be a good day at all. I don't know about you, but I'm just fire. I'm just using a firework, aiming straight up and just trying to not go full speed. So, I'd, oh no, I thought my light just stopped working there. All right, this is the longest I've searched. I got, I've got lucky too many times with NCs and now it's just finally, it's, it's just finally. The, oh wait, at, product, as I talk about that, I've literally just found one. Nice. Oh, I don't think it has a ship. Yeah, it doesn't have a ship. Should I loot it? Nah, I probably shouldn't, should I? It's probably too risky. I don't think we're getting lucky here, honestly. I, I cannot seem to find anything with a ship. There's like, there's there's an island here. Please, just be at end city here. Just come on. Give us the luck. If there's an end city right now, that would be great. Hopefully you get lucky. <gasps> yes! Yes, I got one! I got one! Oh, okay. 
I don't know whether to waste a firework. Okay, I'm gonna waste. Oh my god, it's a it's a it's a pretty huge one as well compared to normal. I don't have any bucket of water as well, so. <gasps> Pod. Oh, oh my god. My elytra just stopped working. I tried clicking space and everything. All of the elytra, everything. And there's no way I can get the quads. I can get all my stuff back. I know that. I can get I can get all my stuff back. It's fine. Oh wow, there it is. Respawn. We're back. We gotta get all of our netherite stuff back. We gotta get it all back. Everything. I mean, I've got diamonds and stuff, so it's not the end of the world. But guys, how has that just happened to us? I literally clicked space as well. Like the elytra just didn't want to work. I don't know if it was like I don't even know what it was. Was it was it lag? I I, I literally have no idea. I'll work on getting my stuff back, no problem. But I actually think I might make a animal farm right now. Alright, so I guess we've got to remake all of our stuff. We gotta go through, make all of our diamond armor again. But don't worry, guys, you know, I'm gonna be able to get all my stuff back. Don't even worry about it. I mean, to be honest, I think the main stuff I had was my pickaxe, and I mean, everything else was pretty easy to get back, so I mean, I'm not really worried about that, but it is just a shame. That is the way we had to lose all of our stuff, man. Literally, just by the elytra's malfunctioning right there. Honestly, I can't even believe it, but for now, we're gonna go down, try and level back up to level 30, go to the nether, get some netherite stuff, and, and get on the way back to getting our pickaxe, because our pickaxe we had was literally insane. But guys, in the rest of this episode, what I wanna do is I wanna build a animal farm. The reason I wanna build some type of barn is just because, I mean, all I've been eating is literally just potatoes, so I definitely wanna try and get a new food source by making some sort of barn outside of my house. Um, I, I want to get rid of the old farm I have and then replace it with some type of barn. And then what I also want to do is name the dog. In fact, I think we have the name tag right now. So while, while we're waiting for some of these skeletons to spawn, I'm actually going to go ahead and name the dog. Now I, now, I already do have a name for the dog. So thank you guys for all the suggestions in the comments of dog names. But I have found one which I really, really like. So we are going to name the dog right now. So shout out to the person on the screen right now for submitting the name Spike. I don't know why. I just, re I just really, really like the name Spike. So we are going to call our dog Spike. I don't know why. I think this name is just really awesome. So thank you guys all so much for the dog suggestions. Also, really Really quickly, if you guys want to leave even more dog name suggestions down below in the comments, who knows? We'll probably get another dog very, very soon. But guys, let's go ahead and name him Spike. I don't know why I really like the name. I just saw the comment and thought, you know what? That is a pretty cool dog name. So I need food real quick. Do we not have a single piece of food? Okay, there we go. We got some food. All right, let's go up to our dog right now and let's name him Spike. Let's see if he likes the name. All right, here he is. Here is Spike. All right, let's give him his name. Boom. There it is. There is Spike. I hope, I hope you guys like the name as well. I just think it's really, really awesome. So there is our dog Spike. Thank you guys all so much again for all the dog name suggestions. But we're going to go with Spike. So there you go, Spike. You got a name tag now, so uh, how does it feel? Okay, interesting. Okay, so I'm pretty sure in one of these chests, I have a pickaxe which has an enchant on it. Yeah, here it is. So I got the efficiency 3 unbreaking 3 pickaxe. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get to level 30. And then I'm going to keep enchanting pickaxes over and over again until I get a good enchant. And then use this pickaxe here to go ahead and get some netherite. I think we're only going to need literally like 4 pieces to get 1 ingot. And then we can go ahead and get our netherite pickaxe back. So guys, let's go ahead and do that. And then after we've done that, I'm pretty sure we're going to make a barn. So yeah. Okay, so as you can see, we've got the max amount of skeletons to spawn. And we're hopefully going to be able to get level 30 by just getting rid of all these. Now that should bring us over level 30 actually. Oh, my. All right, so now that we're over level 30, let's go ahead and try and enchant our pickaxe. For some reason, it's got a bit of damage missing. I might have hit one of the skeletons with it or something. All right, so here we go. Let's take a little bit of lapis. Come on, be good. Be good for the first one. I would... Uh Okay, uh, I'm breaking three, fortune two. I mean, it's not the best, but I mean, I'll take it for now. But guys, something I want to do in an upcoming episode is just build an armory filled with a bunch of armor, a bunch of the best tools, a, a bunch of really good swords. And I just want to be able to go there whenever I want and just get absolutely stacked with the best loot. So maybe, so maybe that's something we can work on for the next episode. All right, so I've made two more pickaxes and I've also resupplied on a bunch of lapis right now for this chest. So let's just fill up as much as we can. Uh, I think we're going to be able to fill up quite a lot. All right, so back to level 30. Let's give it another go. Come on, give us something good this time. Okay, that's good. Oh, okay. I'm okay. That really isn't that bad. If I actually go into my chest, I might have another pickaxe which I could combine with these and maybe get a better one. Okay, so yeah, I actually had a bunch of broken pickaxes laying around. So if we do this correctly, we should be able to actually get a really good pickaxe here. So maybe, so if we get that and then add it to the fortune, uh, do we not have enough levels for that? Okay, yeah, we do. So then we'll get unbreaking three, fortune two, and then efficiency, and then efficiency four. So then what I'm going to do is, so if we use some of the books we have in the enchantment room, we should eventually be able to get obviously fortune three. Now, I think what I'm going to do now is go with MD and head down to the nether and try and get some nether right back. Okay, guys, so me and MD are about to go into the nether, and I need to get this pickaxe, I believe, here to turn to netherite, and then I will obviously get the fortune three at a different time. So, let's just go in, see if we can get right. any luck with the netherite. If we can, that'd be great, and if we can't, then that would suck, because we've literally mined out so much of the nether already, but... Okay, where's right, the... Oh, we need to find where the mine is. Oh, yeah, it's literally right here. Alright, so this is where we're gonna mine for netherite. Apparently, the best way to get netherite is by using TNT. That's probably true. Because it, it but, doesn't explode when you um, TNT yeah. it. So, although I did lose my stuff, before the next episode, I'm definitely going to get all uh, the stuff back. I'm probably going to try and get an elytra again, get all my netherite armor back. And hopefully, I should have that by the next episode. But honestly, the next episode is going to be a good one. So, make sure you guys uh, stay tuned for that. Oh, yes. I found some. Some nice. Yes. Please be more than one. Oh, it was, it was literally just one. That was such a troll. Oh. I, 
I thought I was gonna get lucky on the jackpot right there and just get loads of it, but no, just just the one piece. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna bring TNT next time I do this. Oh! I just got lucky. I got another piece. Nice. It's just one by itself again, though, but I don't mind. I'm, there's lava above me as well. Oh, <gasps> God. I just got another piece. Literally, nice. straight after that other piece. All right. It was, again, it was just another one by itself. All right, one more, and then we can get our netherite pickaxe back. I literally need one more piece. One more piece is all we're looking for here. Oh! As I say that, I literally found a piece. Is it just one by itself? Right. Come on. Maybe maybe lucky with the two? No. Nope. I always mine around it just to double check, but I don't yeah, usually get lucky by doing that. We should honestly... We, we should think about turning the nether into being something a little bit better. Have you seen the absolute just build everywhere? We should make, like, a really nice nether. Like, a nice base or something like that. I don't know. Yeah. Just, just something that looks better than this. Like, we just cobblestone everywhere. But guys... Yeah. We're heading back to the overworld. Gotta turn my pickaxe into a netherite pickaxe, and then I'm probably gonna start on a barn. Okay, here we go. Four pieces of netherite scrap. Boom, boom. There it is. Netherite pickaxe back. Okay, let's start on this barn. Guys, we did it. We have got the beginning Ow. Of our barn. Okay, guys, so we have made the barn. We got the sheep over here. We got three sheep over there, which we're going to start breeding. And then over here, we've got two cows, which we're going to start breeding. And hopefully, it will just turn into a massive animal farm. And I'll have, and then I'll have unlimited supply of food. But, guys, that is basically the start of the barn. It's, to be honest, it's nothing special, but I think it's quite simplistic. I mean, we got some lanterns up here. We got the little sheep hanging out in there. We got the cows. I think it's really, really nice. And it doesn't take up too much space. We can kind of just walk throughout it. And yeah, so I think it's really, really cool. So, guys, something me and the other guys are planning on doing is doing a massive trophy room or just somewhere where we can kind of show off that we defeated the ender dragon and just a place to put all of our achievements so we're probably going to team up in an upcoming episode and make a massive build but apart from that guys i think that's where we are going to end this episode so guys thank you all so much for watching and make sure you do not miss out on the next episode guys because the next one is going to be absolutely insane so guys thank you all so much for the support recently and apart from that guys peace